Well, this is a great start to the series, isn't it? I haven't even loaded in. <laughs> oh well. Well, hello everyone and welcome to a new season of Vault Hunters. Here we are in a brand new world full of possibility and also full of death. I'm already starving. Um, we have an incredible roster of people this season. Can't wait to introduce you to all of the new players as well as all of the familiar faces we know and love. But it is quickly approaching night. I am uh, all alone in this world, so it's about time I get started. Survival first, talking later. Oh, sheep, yes, I can make a bed. Even with a mod pack as complex as Vault Hunters, you've still got to start off on the basics. And uh, the first thing I want to do is uh, set up a little base. I heard a door. I heard a door. <gasps> it's a villager. Okay, if you haven't watched this mod pack before, Look at this cool feature here. <gasps> Where did he go? Where is he? I feel like a magician at a kid's party. Where did he go? He's in my inventory. <gasps> it's a circuit. Ah, angry bees, angry bees. Forgot about that happening. Ah. So I want to have a base in the side of a cliff. And I think this cliff here is actually perfect for that. Alrighty, I have a little bit of a base set up here on the side of this mountain. I think this is where I want to do my starter base. But before all that, let me tell you everything there is to know about this series. If you're new to Vault Hunters, this is basically a modded Minecraft pack. Myself and other players are going to be exploring vaults, which are like dungeons with bosses and loot and all kinds of exciting rooms. As you can see, you start off pretty much as normal, but you can see the terrain is quite different already. Let me tell you, I have some exciting plans for this season. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spend a bit of time just grinding some materials to create a bit of a starter base. Rob! Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, Hello. no. Oh. Oh, no. What? 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 What, what am I missing? He's here. Oh, He's oh me! Here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's yeah, just looking yeah. around like, like a lost person. <laughs> Clearly, my reputation precedes me. What, what can I say? What? Why are you? Why are you staring into the distance? Um, I, I'm no only reason. here. You know, yeah, realize. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, I was just um, breaking the fourth wall. I don't know what that means, hell. <laughs> I don't know what any of this means, to be honest. Oh, cooked mutton. Wait, did you murder some sheep? I mean, do you, do you know how mutton works? Um, actually, not really. <laughs> no, like, I'm not a chef. Fuzzy did try to explain it to me once, and I, I just don't get it. <laughs> In that case, no, no, I, I definitely didn't murder any ah, sheep. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Right. Complete, this is this is a uh, synthetic uh, mutton. Well, I, I just I just thought it would be fun to you know terrorize people on day one. Um, oh, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm like, with that. I'm with you. Looks like that. stair cats online. Hello, hi Stecker. Yeah. Oh, hi. I, I like your skin. Look at that. That's really cool. I did have somebody with me. I don't know what he's doing. Oh. Anyway. Um, that guy. No, not that guy. A, a different guy. <laughs> yeah. Is he here to steal my chromatic iron? Oh, you got chromatic <laughs> iron. Well, I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> This is this is my brand new super serious hell, and I get up to absolutely no mischief. I mean, I, I've so far all I've got is some mutton. What what sort of trouble can I have with mutton? Nah, there you go. You can have that as well, I guess. What, what, what? A pickaxe. Well, this changes everything. Yeah. <laughs> Off we go. Oh no. Stack up. Stack up. I'm in your I'm in your book. I'm in your shelves. Hello. <laughs> if you're gonna stand there the whole series, I'm gonna freak out. <laughs> oh my god, do it. Well, that's not a challenge, isn't it? I'm moving. <laughs> All right, everyone. Uh, welcome to the new Vault Hunter series. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, but welcome to the Volta Hunter series where I just uh, stand in this corner in a Stercut's house and just stay here and stare. Hello. Oh, 
can't. No! no. Why did you break it? No! <laughs> the chaos has already begun. Right, let's get some more progress done so we can start concentrating on the mod pack. And with a bit of grinding, I have made some progress. I've started settling down in my lovely area and I've got a few basic farms to get me started. I've got a bit of wheat going over there, but over here I've made myself a big iron farm, as well as some pumpkin and some sugarcane. And I'm using that iron to trade with villagers. I've got a few different ones down in this corridor and especially I have some two smiths and some weapon smith and these guys will trade me four iron for one emerald as you can see I've got quite a few emeralds now I'm slowly working away at getting all of the different enchantments and I know this season villagers aren't as important but I want to have at least access to all of the books in case I do need them for some reason and that also means that actually it's time to upgrade because I've actually traded for all of the basic armor and gear that I need Hey, there we go, I'm very blue. Now as well as all of these enchantments, I've also started digging out an area which is going to be my starter base. Currently inhabited by these fools, um, this is going to be my starter base. I've also bred just an enormous quantity of bees. I'm still building up a collection of honeycomb blocks which I'm going to need for my starter base. So that is a lot of progress, but I'm ready to do a bit more. And the next step in my adventure is going to be a bit of mining. Now the things we're going to need from this strip mining session, our aim is to build the vault altar. Now the recipe for this has changed from last season and you'll notice that we need one diamond, some obsidian and this thing, the chromatic iron ingot. And that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to go and find some chromatic iron. And while we're there, there's a few other things I want to pick up. Ah! So many things are shooting me already. Oh, what's that? What's that? Chromatic iron or... <laughs> Fuzzy is, is going to kill me. I've literally been mining for, you know, 30 seconds and I found it. And he's been mining for, for days and he has not found any yet. Oh, that's a diamond, isn't it? Wow. This is a good expedition. All right, well, we're done. <laughs> Alrighty, I think we're ready for the big moment. The official start of Vault Hunters Season 2. And there we go. Vault Altar! Woo! I just realised I did a boo boo. I need to go and get a Vault Crystal, don't I? I've been searching for hours for the Vault Stone and I didn't realise that the texture had changed. I believe this is now Vault Stone, isn't it? This is Vault Stone. Ah, so it takes four chipped Vault Rocks and one Chromatic Iron Ingot to uh, get a Vault Rock. All right, we have 14, 14 Vault Rocks. Now let's chuck the first one in. Oh, interesting. I may as well complete this first altar because actually I think I've got everything I need. The only thing I need to find is a spore blossom, but I actually know where to get one. Oh, here we go, this thing here. So this is where I took my bees from. Yeah, there we are. Whoop. Alrighty, so uh, gravel, potatoes, redstone. Ah, <gasps> so complete. All we need is a button. Put that down, press it. Ah. <gasps> First Vault Crystal of the season. Alrighty, so next thing I would like to do is actually work a bit on this room here. I think I'm going to start off by putting in the copper. So maybe this is a good point to let you know what my theme is for this season of Vault Hunters. You see, I am planning to be a witch. That's why my skin looks like this. I'm an emo witch. Also, thank you very much to Stormy for making this lovely skin for me. Oh, I run out of uh, terracotta. Let me just go pick some from nearby. Yeah, so that base up there is going to be my uh, little hermit's cave, essentially, where I'm going to be brewing a load of potions and, uh, and generally just causing a bit of mischief. So one of the things I want to achieve in this season 
is to improve upon all of my talents and perks. If you look in the Vault Hunters menu, there's quite a lot of things that you can do. Um, but just like last season, we've got some abilities, we've got some talents, and we've got some researchers, which are the mods. Now, generally, there's quite a lot of people who focus on the mods. And some of these are quite cool and I will be taking some mods as well. I definitely want to play around with create a bit more this season. So my plan is to go for the minimum amount of mods that I will actually need and focus on my talents and my abilities. The idea is that I am a witch and therefore I have certain powers that make me stronger and more invincible. And so we're going for pretty, pretty tanky build this season. So that's not looking too bad. I think once that oxidizes, it's going to look really, really cool. Um, let's see from a different angle. Yeah, 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 I like that entrance. It's, it's nice, it's nice. So the next thing we need is actually not in this dimension. It's in the nether. Because what I need is some glowstone to actually illuminate this place. Woohoo, nether. Now something I should probably point out is that in Vault Hunters, the vanilla armor is significantly downgraded. So this is actually providing me very little in the way of protection. And in fact, in Vault Hunters 1.18, you can't even add protection to your armor, which means that um, I'm quite squishy, even though I'm in diamond armor. So I've got to be a bit careful of what I'm doing. Oh my God, that did a lot of damage. Oh my God, two hits. Wow, that is... That's pretty brutal. Okay, they've got everything back. Luckily, we've got these this grave mod. Ah! 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 Oh no! This is bad! Maybe I don't need blaze swords that much. I'm in I'm in full armor. And this is this is painful. I can't even make a shield. Well, I've got some some blaze rods. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, I've got five blaze rods. I would like a bit more. The nether is such a scary place here. Ah, 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 <laughs> no. I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it at all. Dad, well, fair enough. Oh, how am I going to get my body back? Okay, right, right, I've got everything. That, that is good, that is good. Oh god, what was that? Something hit me. Something hit me. Something hit me. Ah! <laughs> ah, 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 ah
is great. <laughs> oh, we're just chilling on a camel. Don't mind us. I don't know if this camel can go in water. I'm gonna choose a different route. <laughs> You're a car. Yeah. <laughs> camel, why is this so silly? So silly, I love it. Oh, oh, this is great. They got such long legs. They do. They do. Um, oh. But yeah, no, Code, the reason that I asked you to come over here is because mm -hmm. I've discovered a slight, well, it's not really a loophole, but I've discovered something very useful for our first okay. spot. You see, right. these, you see these structures here? Apparently, uh -huh. they're all over the desert, and within the structures, Ooh. you can find chests, and within the chests, you can find golden uh, golden apples, which Ooh. you need for potions or healing. <laughs> Just heading across in my camel. Ooh, is, chest. It is significantly slower than walking. <laughs> I'll give you that one. Some, yeah. Gunpowder. <laughs> some bones. I'll take the bones. Actually, the gold might not be too bad, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're, they're pretty much everywhere. This is this is pretty good. It's not like we're searching for an hour to find one of them. Well, I think I feel like you found this, so I'm more than happy for you to to take uh, what's inside there. Oh! Yep, yeah, 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 yep, yep. Yeah, Enchanted yeah. golden apple, diamond horse armor. Yep. Diamonds. Yep. Oh, I have it. to give something up. Oh, what do I give up? Oh, water bucket. But I'm just having oh, my this is beautiful. Seat. Oh, God. Oh, whoa. Oh. <laughs> I saw you do that. I'm like, no, that goes, that goes away right now. <laughs> <laughs> I did not mean to do that. That was completely accidental. Oh, oh my God. panic. <laughs> There's a coconut husk yeah. in there for you. I have to go retrieve my camel. He's running away. Yeah. How far is this? Um, <clears throat> no, go coat is so much more desert. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and that means so much more yeah. golden apples. Yeah. When you get your head in the leaves, it slows you way down. Just another inconvenience <laughs> related <laughs> to mean, the camels. Why, why are these things so majorly inconvenient? We get the most inconvenient possible yeah. travel well, method. We're also in the worst biome for it because it's all leaves. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> nope. No. Well, I gotta traverse some leaves. Okay. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. No. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe <laughs> I'm stuck in the leaves. <laughs> I can't get off. Oh. Now I left my base to oxidize overnight. And I gotta say, it, it's great. I really like this. The entrance is a bit awkward at the moment, but this is what it looks like inside. I think it looks incredible. Uh, we've got our little underground area, which we can then expand later on. Uh, but for now, we've just got our altar here. Uh, I've started bringing up all of our potions. I've got quite a good amount of instant health potions. In fact, I'm going to grab some of them now. And I've actually spent some time getting myself some netherite gear. I've not quite managed to get all the tools yet, but I've got the armor. And that's going to make a bit of a difference in our first vault. And talking about first vault, I've teased this enough. Let's actually do it. All right, let's try that. Ooh, awesome. Alrighty, here we go. Ooh, I should probably put myself a temper. Oh, there's no map. Okay, interesting. So you can't actually save where you are. Okay, okay, we've got beginner's grace, uh, which means that if I die, um, I'm gonna be okay. Okay, right. Uh, I need to remember how to do this. Um, excellent, okay, uh, let's keep on going. Okay, I don't know what everything does. We will find out later. For now, let's just loot. Woo, mini wobs, okay. Uh, run, 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 run. Oh, two monoliths. Do I really want to fight a boss on my first vault? Also, I'm already lost. Oh dear. The design of these vaults is really cool. Look at this. Wait, is this because it's beginner's grace that uh, all these rooms look quite similar? Oh, no, this is a different room. Oh, it looks like some kind of crystal room. <gasps> Crystals! Oh, wow, wow. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, those hit. Oh, those hit hard. Those hit hard. 
Wow, lots of things, lots of things, lots of things. I'm in a hole. Oh god, this is a bad start. I do not like this. <laughs> okay, <laughs> the difficulty is definitely high already. Oh god. Oh, so many things are trying to kill me. Uh, I do want to get some of those ores, but actually no, I don't think it's worth it. I'm going to keep on going. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Oh, what's that? Oh god. Oh no, oh no, slowness. Ah, <laughs> I forgot how scary these places are. Oh, dear me. Well, at least I got beginner's grace, so if I do die, you know, it's okay. Okay, that's my last potion. Um, <laughs> so, I guess I'm going to be doing a lot more running now. Can I draw them away and then go back? What's that going to get me killed? No, it looks like it could work. Okay, okay, that's the, that's the new... Uh, the new mentor <laughs> spawn things in run away <laughs> wait for them to come back uh, and and loot in the meantime oh god right so these are just zombies so if i lure them out right all the way through here and then i run back in oh my god what am i doing this is a death trap this is a death trap but if i lure them out come on come on come on you come this way Right, that should give me just about enough time to loot at least one chest. Just grab everything. Oh, there's another way out, actually. Ah! 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 Okay, okay, they hit me, they hit me. Uh, right, okay, so how do I get out of this place? So this feels like, yeah, okay, I think I need to just go, keep going straight. Okay, we've got less than 10 minutes, I need to find a way out. But actually, I think, this may be looking promising, I think, it may be this way. Right, that's the end portal, isn't it? Awesome, okay, let's do a tiny bit more looting in this room here. Oh, there's an upstairs, oh, there's mobs up there, though. No, 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 it's one of those guys. Oh, no, I'm on one heart, oh, God, no, run, 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 run. Oh, no, run, quicker, quicker, quicker. Oh, that guy's going to kill me. That guy's going to kill me. Oh, no, I need to keep running. I can't even look back because he's going to catch up. Come on, come on. One heart, one heart. <gasps> we did it! <laughs> Excellent. So what do we get? We got a few different things. We got magnetite, steel nuggets, chromatic ore, vault apples, which we can use to make more potions. Uh, carbon, chromatic iron nugget. Okay, so not too bad. We've got a few different things and bits and bobs. So we'll deal with what all of this means in the next episode, I think. But I think with that, it's going to be the end of this episode. I've made a whole load of progress in uh, the last few days and I'm very excited to see where this adventure takes us. I'm also terrified. That vault was pretty scary, if I'm being honest. But I hope you have enjoyed this episode and if you have, please remember to comment, like and subscribe and I'll see you all in the next one.